We always went on Saturday afternoon to the cowboy matinee. I remember coming here and watching Star Wars. There were five of us girls, and we would load up with a parent, and they would bring us up here, and we would get popcorn and candy and soda. The very first movie that I saw here at the Rogers Theater was The Lion King. I remember the Rogers of running around with my brothers and having my mom and dad and all the family together. It was just a really magical time. For nearly 70 years, the Rogers Theater has been a focal point of downtown Poplar Bluff. Over the decades, thousands of people have passed through its doors. While the use of the theater has changed over time, the mission has remained the same, to provide a place where people can enjoy themselves and create memories. As an integral part of downtown Popper Bluff, it seems everyone has a special memory of the Rogers Theater. One thing I do remember is we always went on Saturday afternoon uh, to the Cowboy Matinee. Of course, we had Roy Rogers, uh, Gene Autry, uh, Lash LaRue, Whip Wilson, Sunset Carson, Hopalong Cassidy, who was William Boyd, but he went by Hopalong Cassidy. And we always had cartoons. Uh, there was always a, uh, an animated cartoon. Uh, and it would be Bugs Bunny or Woody Woodpecker or Tom and Jerry or Casper the Friendly Ghost. And, and some of those things were just getting started, later became much more famous even. And there was always a newsreel, uh, world events, and uh, a roundup of, of the important news of the day. That, that happened every single Saturday afternoon. I remember the Rogers of running around with my brothers and having my mom and dad and all the family together. And then as I grew up, taking my dates to the Rogers for a movie or going hanging out with my buddies and watching a movie at the Rogers. So it has a lot of fond memories of the Rogers back when I was growing up. One of my fondest memories of coming up, loading up a van full of my friends. There were five of us girls and we would load up with a parent and they would bring us up here and we would get popcorn and candy and sodas. And it was just a really magical time. I did come here on one of my first dates. Actually, my parents came along too, which is a little embarrassing now, but back then that's what we did. I was a little bit younger. So we came and we watched Dumb and Dumber. And if anybody knows my father, Butch Frazier, Dumb and Dumber is not a movie that he would enjoy greatly. So he suffered through it for me. The atmosphere in this theater has always drawn me in.